All right, this is Crota giving you an audio commentary on Plunder Isle between Spellex and Bjark. Um, this is going to be orange on the top left-hand corner. Going to spawn at the go ahead and spawn at the two o'clock position, and it's going to build an altar of kings. Meanwhile, we have an altar of kings coming from Bjark as well, or OSG. Not quite sure how to pronounce his name, but we do have a standard altar of kings and a peasant building a farm. I'm assuming that peasant's going to go out and start building a barrack soon. Um, that is a rather unusual build, so that barracks is coming out a little bit late from Barjark, or maybe he just has a different build order than I'm used to. Yeah, that barracks is coming out a little bit late. Perhaps he wants to use that peasant to go ahead and do a scout farm. Meanwhile, we have back over here on the top, we do have the standard altar of kings, barracks, and farm being produced. And um, really don't know what to say. I haven't really heard of these players very much. Um, I do know, I, I do recognize the teams, but... Beyond that, I really don't know what strategies are going to really going to go. It looks as though both players are going to be going footmen, as there are no, um, there is no early gathering of, of lumber too much. Meanwhile, it looks as though, um, I don't know, th this particular spawn you got to be careful because it is going to be a little difficult to gather your wood. If you notice, all the places to gather wood are a little bit further away. The bottom position seems to have a little bit more. Um, a luxury in where they gather wood and we do have Bjark going ahead. I'm just going to call him Teal. I'm going to go ahead and try to get up a lumber mill quickly up and running so that he, he doesn't get too fall too behind on wood. Meanwhile, we do have an Archmage and Footman coming out. We have a Scouting Peasant coming in as well. So the Scouting Peasant, it looks as though he, the Militia is going to go ahead and turn back into a Peasant here and build perhaps a Scout Farm. And we're going to have the Archmage come out very shortly so both players going archmage and footman um i don't see this is the first footman coming from bjark so i don't see a second footman out and this is rather unusual for, oh yeah bjark did build that barracks up a little bit late so only one footman to start creeping for bjark we're gonna have um, a single drop of a water elemental and gonna go ahead and try start creeping this meanwhile B, um, um, spell x is gonna go ahead and do the same exact creeping with militia as well I don't really see why you need Militia on this particular creep camp. It's just three level one units, and those units are going to go down very quickly, especially on a map where you are going to be hurt for lumber a little bit more. Perhaps those peasants will be able to get in a little bit more on this fight, going after the level three creep camp, and it is going to go ahead and give this Archmage level two, if if I can guesstimate, that'd be my best guess. Meanwhile, we do have a quick um, scout tower being built, and it looks as though we're going to have a perhaps a fast expansion attempt. We do have um, the Ogre Magi going after that one particular um, peasant who is currently building that building. Now, if, now careful, that peasant is going to go down. Now we do have a transferring of the transferring of the uh, focus firing from that Ogre Magi now trying to head back. We do have two scout farms being built in the middle of the map, so Spellux is going to know where, um, where the, the creeping or the other army is going to be coming from. Um, my apologies, Archmage did not get to level 2, so currently sitting at level one and it looks as though we are going to go ahead and both players are going to go ahead and try to creep out this um, natural expansion very quickly. We do have a fast expansion att attempt from Bjark, the teal player, building it with three um, peasants and an arcane tower up front. Meanwhile, we have the Ogre Magi and getting surrounded by militia and footmen, you know, getting that water mantle doing a good job tanking, grabbing a gloves of haste and it looks as though there's going to be five peasants going to go here and build up that expansion. We do have a lot of peasants back on, and obviously both players still currently sitting at Town Hall since they do did do a fast expansion attempt. Um, Bjark's base looks a little bit more open, and we do have scout farms in place, so um, Spellex does know where Bjark is. It looks as though Bjark wants to go ahead and try to take down that scouting scouting farm, and we are going to have the Archmage going to go ahead and try to take down this particular footman as well. It looks as though, um, no, just... Bjark just seems to want to go ahead and try to take down this expand or this farm for and he just doesn't like it perhaps. We do not have the expansion up and running for Spellex yet, so we are gonna have a slight economic advantage for Bjark as he is gonna go ahead and complete that um scout or complete that expansion with four peasants, gonna perhaps build the fifth one, and now we have um, Spellex going ahead trying to take going and put some pressure. We do have the expansion finally coming down. We have four peasants just sitting around doing nothing. And I, I gotta believe that they're gonna go ahead and try to expand soon, um, or start building building soon. We do have that arcane tower, and that single arcane tower is positioned nicely on a hill, so not able to attack it, and um, easily. Now we're gonna have the archmage go ahead and try to 
perhaps come into this base, but there are a good amount of peasants, so those peasants are going to be able to call to arms and push back this attack. Two low hit point footmen and currently in the back against what, what I call three footmen and a, a, and a water elemental. That Spellix's footman is also going to get focused down rather quickly, and it looks like those Bjarks um, footman is going to be able to get away. We are going to have an arcane vault being built. We do have some low hit point footmen already in the back, and it looks as though that peasant uh, or those footmen want to go after those peasants try to slow down this economy so it looks like a couple of peasants in the red and now we do have footmen going ahead and trying to stop this it would, down goes a peasant and another peasant's going to go down and we have just good pressuring coming from um spellex on bjark so bjark is now trying to take down that single water elemental able to get the water elemental down so now we have only two water elementals and an archmage going ahead trying to counter this um counter this attack now we have a peasant moving all the way to the back of the base trying to get away and it looks as though the water elemental is gonna is he gonna get that last kill off yes he gets the kill before he goes down so both players you know spellix is currently sitting almost at level three if he gets one more footman kill i believe he will get to level three as well and yet yeah, anime gets to level three so level three on that archmage the archmage is going to drop a, a very nice water elemental very soon um, those level two water mentals, meanwhile, looks like those Bjark is going to go ahead and just sit in the back of the base, try to go after these peasants. Oh, very nicely done, ha shooting over those trees, trying to take down those units, and another footman's going to go down. So, Spellux is doing a very good job um, do putting pressure on this base. We do have an expand, or Spellux now going to tier two as well. So, tier two for Spellux as he's microing those footmen in and out of this out of this battle. Spellux is now tr trying to run to the trying to run away those his foot or his water mantles are on cooldown and he does not have any more mana drop water mantles at this time one additional footman running around across the map it looks as though those footmen are gonna be able to go ahead and and heal back up so nicely done by spellex spellex now currently sitting at level three three and a half almost oh yeah three and a third meanwhile we have um bijar currently sitting at level two those it looks as though those foot, uh, those peasants are going to go down. We do have one low hit point footman who is running out for no real reason because he is going to get killed. Trying to get killed by the tower. No, does not get killed by the tower. And the Archmage of, of Bijark, the teal player, is going to go ahead and hit level 3 as well. So now we have a water element to go in, going ahead and push out. And we do have those scout farms um, still in the middle of the map. We do have peasants sitting around doing nothing. I, I believe Spellex should be able to hit f8 and be able to get that really really quickly i don't know why those peasants are just sitting around doing nothing um, meanwhile it looks as though the archmage is going to go ahead and head back we do have a lot of low hit point units and we have mass towers coming from spellex as um, bjark is going to go ahead and waste some time trying to take down this farm so very interesting early game so far both players deciding to go ahead and do a fast expansion both players getting that fast expansion up fairly quickly and being able to defend it Meanwhile, we do have um, towers coming up as well. So it looks as though a Bjark is going to go ahead and uh, see this um, scout farm. I'm going to go ahead and try to run past it because he most likely knows that there is an expansion up and running for Spellex. So it, let's go ahead and see what Bjark is going to go ahead and try to do. He's going to go ahead and come up. And now we do have the Spellex now coming around the corner. He does have a Clarity Potion and Healing. So we are going to have a good amount of healing coming down. Meanwhile, those Spellex is now taking a good amount of damage on those peasants. Those those peasants are protected by that tower, but that tower is, not, is you know, doing a very good amount of damage. Oh, Bjark does have a low hit point footman, and that footman does go down, trying to get a surround on the Archmage. No, no surround on the Archmage, and Bjark is going to go ahead and force the push, and is going to take some damage. Oh, nice play by Bjark. Bjark go, goes ahead and it calls over the creeps, but those, but those creeps are not going to go ahead. Are they going to go ahead and start damaging these units? Or no, he's just going after Bjark, so those creeps not... I'm really engaging against uh, against Spellex. Very nicely done, and we're going to have a mass teleport coming from Bjark. Now we do have keep upgraded for Bjark, and Bjark is now getting some arcane sanctums. Two of them to be, two two of them in fact. Meanwhile, we have an upgrade to castle. So we have Spellex deciding to go ahead and upgrade the castle. Those footmen may have may be smart to go ahead and try to push out, unsure of when those guard towers are going to be nearing completion. And we have guard uh, castle being upgraded for Bjark as well. So both players going to castle relatively early we have unfinished farms as well <clears throat> okay i'm gonna go ahead and take this time to go ahead well we have a couple action over here i'm gonna take this time to go ahead and um focus down or you know, i'm gonna pause the game stay tuned for part two